Pet of the Week is sponsored by My Pets Vet. Hey everybody, happy Furry Friday. Today we are talking all things Pet of the Week and we have such a special pet here, but first, Tiki from Lifeline Animal Project. Yeah, thank you so much for coming. It is so nice to be here with yes. you. So this is Echo, as you mentioned, has a little bit of a sad backstory. Echo was found abandoned in a local hotel. Um, he was a little underweight when we first found him, as you can see, but he is quickly fattening up a little bit. Uh, our staff has been taking really good care of him. He's a little bit shy when you first meet him, but okay. he leans in and loves his snacks and his pets and his people. And I think he's gonna be a love bug and provide a family with a whole lot of love. Truly, he's so behaved, he's got an incredible disposition. Yes. What kind of family would you think would be best suited? Yeah, he's a survivor and you can tell he's been through a lot, but I think that any family that has a patience and has some love and some room in their home for an animal like this, and just wants to work with him, I think he'll be great with really any family that's looking for love. And I he love needs that. love too. We do need love, and especially this weekend, give a lot of oh. love to your pets. It's gonna be a big weekend, especially yeah. temperature-wise. Yeah. So let's talk about the tips and tricks for keeping our pets cool, healthy, confident, having a good time. <laughs> yeah, so we wanna be weather aware when it comes to our pets as well. Pets, because they're covered in fur, they don't have the same cooling system that we do mm -hmm. as humans. So they heat up a little bit more quickly. They can actually, they can actually heat up 40 degrees in just a few minutes, and that can be deadly for a pet. So if you're gonna be outdoors, make sure you have lots of water with you, be in a shaded area like we are right, right. now. If you're walking on a, a cement surface or pavement, if you're at a fair or something like that, just be careful booties. about their, yeah, be okay. careful about their little paws or yes. their little toe beans, as we say, because they toe can get beans. burnt. That's right. And we don't want that to happen. So just be careful That's when right. you have your pets outdoors. Now I've heard about the rule. Yes. The rule where if you place your hand on the ground, if it's too hot, it's too hot for your hound. It's too hot for the hound, yes. precisely. Okay, so good, that's a good, good way to think about that. That's a good trick. And mm -hmm. obviously, no leaving pets in cars. Absolutely and I've got to call 911 immediately if you right. see a pet in a car, right? And even outdoors, if you have a pet that likes to be outdoors, be sure that they have a mm -hmm. bowl of water there. You can even put some little ice cubes in it to make sure that it stays cool. And make sure it's a bowl that won't tip Perfect. over, because if the water tips over, then they don't have any water to drink, and right. that's a problem. And especially when we're having those family gatherings, things like that, you just want to make sure that you're attentive to your dog. Yes, your yes. Pet. And yes. even when they're exercising, just make sure they have water That's and they're good. staying hydrated. So good. Well, we want to talk about volunteer opportunities. Yeah. A lot of shelters have a lot of dogs. Yeah. So we have uh, amazing Emily yes, here. Emily, Hello. One of our volunteers. Yes. We are having a big event at our Fulton County Animal Services Shelter this week in our foster showcase. We are in dire need of fosters and adopters right now. We have a lot of animals coming into our shelters. We'll have a chance to learn about our foster program. Great. How you can become a foster. We have snacks and food and mm. of course an animal for you to take home. And we hope that people will volunteer to help us out. We love that. Help your community. Adopt a pet. Thank you so much, Tiki. Have Thank you. Weekend. It's always a pleasure to be here. Thank you. <laughs>